Hey, how's it going, sports fans? I'm here live with Stan Van Gunny at the MIT Sloan Sports Analytic Conference. How are you doing today, Stan? I'm doing well, thanks. Could you tell us a little bit about the panel you were on yesterday and the one you'll be speaking on later today? Well, yesterday we were basically talking about coaching firings, which unfortunately I have recent experience <laughs> in. Um, and then today we're talking about basketball analytics, you know, how we can use the numbers uh, to, to better inform player personnel decisions and coaching decisions. Okay, and how do you feel about the relatively quick tone or turnover of executives and coaches in sports today? Well, there's more more quick turnover of coaches than there are of executives. You know, seems to me executives usually can get through about three coaches before they're on the line. But um, I'm not sure it's good for organizations. Clearly, I'm biased, but I think if you look at organizations like Boston, who stuck with Doc Rivers through some very yeah. tough times and got a championship team. If you look at the continued success of the Utah Jazz when they had Jerry Sloan for 20-plus years, if you look at Greg Popovich in San Antonio, I think you can see the value of continuity. Unfortunately, on the part of fans, media, and ownership, there's not always that patience to stay the course. So do you think that analytics play too large of a role in these types of decisions? Are people too worried about numbers, field goal percentage, or is it more based on the coach's relationship with the players? Well, no, I, I think, look, it, what it all comes down to is winning and losing. I mean, that, and that is what it should come down to. And, and so I think when you get focused on the other things at the expense of winning and losing, that's where you make mistakes. But I also think you have to understand there's going to be ups and downs. You're going to have times where a team doesn't play well, and a coaching change isn't necessarily – going to get you out of that. I mean, we've seen it time and time again. Generally, what will happen after a coaching change, team will play better for a little while. They sort of go back to playing who they were, you know. And over time, I think continuity has a value in that you have a consistent style of play. So because of that, you can draft to a style of play. You know what kind of players fit your system. I think it helps everybody in the organization. I think the turnover is difficult. Thank you so much, Dan. Okay. That's a wrap, sports fans. I'm Robert DeRogers here live at the MIT Sloan Sports Analytic Conference.